Hey guys, welcome back. Get ready with me for our game today against Indiana. Okay, so today, like I said, we play Indiana at home and we are in the midst of a literal blizzard right now. Like I'm not even getting a full on blizzard. This is the amount of snow outside on my deck. It has been truly treacherous times. Every single day going to practice or like shoot around feels like a fight for my life. Just to like get my car even prepared to drive and then to proceed to drive on the roads. It has been nothing short of terrifying. But nonetheless, the show must go on. So Indiana got here today. I think their flight was at 10 a.m. their time maybe. So they landed safely, which is good. And we are ready for the game tonight at 7 p.m. But yeah, it has been H-E double hockey sticks in Iowa City. And yeah, there's just like, I can't even describe it to you guys. It's literally like Antarctica. And I was talking to Gabby this morning on our way to shoot around. And I was like, it's so insane that this same place that truly looks like the tundra also in six months, I think, will have like a heat advisory. And it's all in the same state. The state is extremely bipolar. It's so annoying. Okay, hair is done and out of the way so we can get on to the fun stuff, the makeup. Okay, so we're putting on some primer, but I really need to declutter my makeup bag because we've been traveling so much. And like in New York City, I added in like a bunch of makeup I normally wouldn't take. Um, and it's just time to go through it because I've been living out of my suitcase for like the past two weeks, it feels like. So I need to go through that. Also, I'm in desperate need of like a full, like get everything done. Like I really need to wash my hair. I need to do my eyebrows. I need to do a face mask. My skin is just like not happy at the moment. I need to shave my, oh, I need to shave my legs. Like I just, I need a day where I can just kind of take care of everything. Hopefully tomorrow since we have the day off. Also, we start class back up on Tuesday, except for because of the horrible conditions, all of our classes have been moved to online, which I'm kind of thankful for because I don't know if I'm ready to go back to class, let alone brave these temperatures walking around on campus. Because for those of you who have never been to our campus, there's truly nowhere to park, literally ever. So even if your class is like, there's parking near it, you're gonna have to walk. And I'm, I don't feel like walking outside when this, it's just like white. I don't want to walk outside in that. Also, speaking of classes, I've changed my class schedule like I think four times because I changed my major for my freshman year. So I'm going to be a teacher, an elementary teacher. And I applied to the program this fall and I didn't get accepted before I was able to make my schedule. So I made my schedule with some education classes, but then I got accepted into the program. And so there's like a different string of classes I was supposed to take. So I had to change my schedule so I could fit in those classes. And then I had a meeting with my advisor and I was in like a history class and she was like, yeah, you just simply don't need to take this. And so I dropped that class and added in another education class. And so like four days before I'm supposed to start classes, I finally finalized my schedule for real. So because of the weather, I'm not expecting a ton of people to be there. I know a lot of like the players, like my teammates, our families had plans on coming down and a lot of them changed their mind. My mom, dad, and sister were all supposed to come. And now just my dad is coming and I'm still a little bit nervous about him driving in this weather. Um, and then Devin's here. He drove up a couple days ago. So he's coming to the game at least. But yeah, I know that there's gonna be some Hawk fans just because Hawk fans are not as scared of a little bit of snow, you know? They're Last night, in different news, I finally took down all my Christmas decorations. It's pretty depressing, but I was like ready for a reset. I just felt so like... Also, huge shout out to all the Purdue fans that informed me of what a boil maker is for my last Get Ready With Me because I genuinely had no idea. Here's King Devin. <sighs> Making an appearance. Say hi. Hi. Uh, what do you have to tell them? Go Hawks. Hey, 
that a boy. Okay, I'm all ready to go. So we'll see you at the game. Bye, everyone.